From the ICM Awards to the CMA Awards, and yes, the sky is the limit. On a night, country music's biggest stars perform here on 508 News News. We talk to a relatively new artist with Minnesota ties who hopes to one day be on the stage with those big names. Prince and Bob Dylan, of course, are household names in Minnesota music. Could Larissa be next? She's already being called Nashville's best kept secret. Meet this up and coming artist and find out how she got where she is today. Tonight, many of you watch the Country Music Awards Music Festival here on ABC. The majority of those artists started out playing small venues. They had to pay their dues to reach superstardom. Now a relatively new artist with Minnesota ties is hoping to one day be standing on the CMA stage. Yeah, some country insiders call her Nashville's best kept secret. Ellen McNamara is here with her story tonight, Ellen. Bill and Leah, her name is Larissa, and she hopes one day that country music fans will know her name like they know the names Faith, Carrie, and George. Larissa Lundstrom released her first album back in 2011. Her next album is expected to come out this fall. She's originally from South Dakota, and because her dad was a professional drummer, she grew up in the music business. Larissa arrived in Minnesota in 1997, when she started attending college at North Central University. Unlike some of the country artists that you heard from tonight, Larissa's music is in the inspirational country music genre. Now, it's country music that features three things, faith, family, and country. Two of her songs have already hit number one on the ICM chart. Though you can find a lot of uh, the mainstream country artists who have released music in inspirational country music, and it means a lot to me because all those three of those things, faith, family, and country, are very important to myself as far as growing up and all of those things and, and what made me who I am. Now, Josh Turner, a lot of people know him. He's in mainstream country, and he first had success in inspirational country. Right now, you can find Larissa's music on iTunes, and she'll also be performing at the State Fair. And then on September the 8th, she'll sing the national anthem at the Twins game. Bill? All right, go Larissa. We hope to hear more from her. Thanks, Ellen. You're sitting on the fence at my expense. You're losing time on your second chance. You better stop 